Hello and welcome to this breakout session about the new V23 features and improvements in BricsCAD Lite and Pro. My name is Dimitris Sapios. I'm a pre-sales consultant for Brixis with a background in civil engineering. And firstly, we're going to discover how BricsCAD is leading in 2D CAD and 3D modeling. Let's dive straight in. These DWG files contain floor plans, sections, and 3D details of a new project currently in the planning phase. One of the first tasks we need to face is to ensure that these drawings are properly optimized so we can take full advantage of the tools that BricsCAD V23 has to offer. After taking a closer look, we notice that several legacy dynamic blocks have been implemented in the floor plans. The radius of the table and the number of the surrounding chairs can be changed. The brand new parametric block assist command activates our new converter tool. We can now easily convert the selected arrangement into a BricsCAD parametric block and even export the converted block to the components folder. Our drawing explorer confirms the conversion, but the existing dynamic block remains in our block library, giving us the flexibility to choose between the two. We can now insert the newly created parametric block using the scaling of our choice. The context-sensitive quad menu recognizes this highlighted object as a parametric block reference. The pre-existing legacy parameters are sorted within the properties panel, giving us full access to the visibility states of the block. We can further edit this parametric block, applying new parameters to it, auto constraints and reference curves, options that enable higher levels of customizability and ease of placement. In order to further optimize these plans, we need to visit the Manage tab. The Purge command is an efficient way to clean our drawing. The new command window offers us a fresh visual overview of all the unused items, for example, layers or materials we would like to discard. BricsCAD has many tools in its arsenal that can be used for drawing optimizations. The new Drawing Health feature allows us to activate multiple tools at once. The tutorial gives us helpful information about the three automation levels available, as well as the creation of custom routines. Using the plus icon, we can add the tasks we want to assign to this routine. In this case, I'm creating and saving a new one that helps me quickly delete all duplicate block definitions. Using the interactive mode, we have full control of the process by manually selecting and confirming the duplicate block definitions that are about to be deleted. Switching over to 3D modeling has never been easier. We're just two clicks away from the modeling workspace with access to all 3D tools so we can immediately start evaluating the geometry of our structure. In this scenario, we discovered that the columns in this particular section are not properly aligned, creating unwanted bending stress, a common issue during my time as a structural engineer, which always led to cost-ineffective solutions. Using the brand new tool palettes, we can find the arrange function to help us fix this issue. The same command can be also found in the ribbon. Arrange has been a part of BricsCAD since V22, but in V23, the user experience has been upgraded with a new prompt panel. We can now choose the kind of alignment we desire in all separate axes, and by clicking the colored plane, we can also dynamically move our items in every direction. Last but not least, all the Feng Shui aficionados out there We'll be glad to hear that we can guarantee the most accurate positioning for your plants and evenly distribute them by gaps with absolute precision. Productivity and user experience are right at the top of our priorities. Let's take a closer look under the hood 
at how BricsCAD V23 can improve your workflow performance. During the planning phase of a project, having a structured overview of the deliverable plans is vital. With that in mind, we updated the Sheet Sets panel, giving it a more modern look, making it easier for you to organize, categorize, and publish your sheets. This is just one example of our long-term mission to enhance your experience when using BricsCAD. Applying custom properties and exporting plans are tasks that require just two mouse clicks. The look and feel of our user interface goes hand in hand with the ability to be as productive as possible. Our new tool palettes is the perfect example. It has been completely recoded in Qt, our new UI foundation. Qt will help us deliver the best, most modern interface across all platforms, Windows, macOS, and Unix. This side panel organizes the command icons in tabs and categories for you to quickly access them. The BricsCAD Tools tab contains a collection of BricsCAD's unique toolset. We can further edit this palette. By using the plus icon, we can add a separator line between the icons, a text description for your subcategory, and new tools on our palette. The search bar on the top helps us find and insert the commands we require. Retaining high levels of customizability is our main focus during development. As a result of this philosophy, you have the option to freely drag and drop the separator lines, texts, and tools anywhere within this tool palette. Losing valuable time is every designer's nightmare. In order to avoid that, we need to be able to offer a solution for every scenario, including situations where unexpected events occur. The Drawing Recovery Manager lets us browse the backup files we want to recover and get back to work quickly. As long as we're on the subject of valuable time, let's discover some new features that enable us to design faster. The Lasso is a new arrow in our quiver for higher precision during object selection. Using Lasso, you can select this double bed block reference and quickly replace it with a single bed block using the Express Tools tab. With V23, the Express Tools are a part of BricsCAD straight out of the box, offering a wide set of helpful tools. Without any separate installation requirements, you have access to command icons that help you explode and export attributes faster, align and modify texts to your liking, and even create super hatches or modify your X data. Many BricsCAD users will be excited to hear about this new addition. In case you're new to BricsCAD and in need of a quick onboarding session, we've got you covered. By visiting the new Tips panel, you can find helpful information about the essential features that set us apart. Learn more about our selection cycling and the keyboard shortcuts you can use to speed up your workflow. You can also press Ctrl during your selection to toggle between segments, faces, edges, or solids. Helpful tips are waiting for you about how the hotkey assistant or the quad menu work with step-by-step -step instructions and links to our help center. You can learn about how the Drawing Explorer can be used to manage your layers, attachments, blocks, and more from a single location while getting a list of all the necessary commands to access every category. If you're new to computer-aided design, you can learn everything you need to know to get started with the basic functions. Additionally, we have implemented a section with all new BricsCAD V23 features to ensure you're always up to date. The new connect command, for example, allows us to connect lines, arcs, and polylines, even if they don't touch, as demonstrated in this animated image. Let's put that to the test by selecting the outer lines of this stove. Using the right click, we can activate our context-sensitive quad menu. The quad menu 
recognizes the entities we just selected and suggests commands that can be applied on those specific entities. With our mouse movement, we can further expand the command categories and find out how we can edit or modify them. As we can see, the connect command is one of the first suggestions. The quad menu and the properties panel confirm the polyline conversion. When it comes to conversions, there is no other command that can demonstrate the power of conversion better than Blockify. One of the functions of Blockify is its ability to scan the whole drawing, detect, and convert all the entities that share the same geometry with our selected source entities into blocks. In V23, we enhanced Blockify with a visual feedback in the form of green tick circles, giving you full control of the conversion process. You can even uncheck the unwanted objects. In the end, we can select all similar blocks and confirm the result using the properties panel. Parametric Blockify has also been improved, having now the ability to include constraint geometry and support flip lines and stretch actions. This feature allows us not only to convert multiple entities into blocks, but also to apply all pre-existing parameters to them. In this case, we have created a parametric block that depicts a door. The green lines represent the flip lines of this block, and by visiting the Properties panel, we can find and change the parameters that control the following visibility states. The swing of the door, the hinge side, and the wall side. By following the same process, Parametric Blockify can scan the whole drawing and swiftly apply the same parameters to every door that has the same geometry. Another brand new feature is the AI Assist with its dedicated tab on the top right of a ribbon. By signing up to BricsCAD Usage Data Program, our algorithms analyze the behavior and command suggestion of all participants and gives you command suggestions and even personalized command suggestions based on your workflow. The final toolbar depicts commands that will most likely be suitable for your next move. The AI Assist tab is not the only new feature in a ribbon. We have enhanced the way you select your interface by creating a new interface settings prompt window. In one convenient location, you have the option to switch to our new modern layout, change the theme mode, the panel system, and even enable menu bars or customize workspaces. We encourage you to try out the new modern layout as it offers a refreshing look and feel in combination with a more intuitive tool organization scheme. Improvements in performance and compatibility are not always visible with a naked eye. In BricsCAD v23, you will experience an increased performance when selecting or deselecting thousands of different entities. Performance and usability have been tweaked when importing and editing tables, and last but not least, we can now support the HSPC hexagon standard point cloud format. Copyguided 3D has also been improved in this version. In V22, Copyguided made the jump from two-dimensional space into the 3D realm addressing solid bodies. This year, we expanded its scope and it can also be applied to faces. To demonstrate this new feature, we will try and copy this balcony skirting by using the face detection of Copy Guided. We open up the tool palettes and select Copy Guided. By activating the manually specify source faces option, we gain control of the face selection process. We can reset the selection, manually specify the faces, or even let the software automatically detect them for you. After confirming the selection, this detailing can only be applied on balconies that fit those faces.
This wide range of improvements and new features outline our ongoing mission in Brixis to supercharge your productivity and user experience. Make sure you don't miss the rest of the breakout sessions so you can be up to date with all the new upgrades that BricsCAD v23 has to offer. Thank you for your attention, and I hope you enjoyed this session.